Hi. Well, that was Mass Effect 3. Oh, was it the longest one? Yeah, I guess so. It was in the longest playthrough of the Mass Effects. Yeah, I don't know. I guess that is the objectively best ending, probably, because everyone's alive and everyone's getting along. And yeah, the only loss is me. But won't the Reapers be back someday? I don't know. Maybe not. Anyway, yeah. Oh, 60 FPS of text scrollage. Anyway, yeah, um, yeah, don't really have anything to say. Yeah, I do, because this has been quite an adventure, hasn't it? God, I've gotten through this in very short time. I don't know when I started recording it, but I've done a lot of recording of this in, like, within one month. So I, I feel like it's kind of only just started. Like it really does feel like this was really short, but obviously it wasn't. But yeah, I don't really get the hate for this game. I mean, obviously the the planet scanning and stuff, the side quests are mostly a load of crap, and. I don't think I actually played the game before the extended ending thingy got made. Like, I think I already had the extended ending when I played it the first time. So I guess I didn't experience the ending how it was before. But yeah. I don't know. I guess this probably is my my least favourite of the three games in general, overall. Although the first one has my least favourite combat, I think. And I think 2 is my favourite overall. I like the first one for its like world and its atmosphere and everything. But 2 and 3, especially 3, has more Garrus action. So how can you say no? This one is my favourite for that. Yeah, so like all three of them are, are a favourite for a different reason. First one for atmosphere and world and everything. It's very unique and special. Like the first one really feels like a special game. And the uh, equipment stuff, the, the equipment customization and stuff in that game feels a lot more interesting and unique and deep. The second game, I like the the general gameplay more and everything. And this game has more Garrus. Also it has the Citadel DLC and stuff now, which was awesome. But overall, just a, a great trilogy. Very memorable, obviously. I mean I can't really say anything that everyone else hasn't gone on about, but I feel like this game gets a lot of undue hate. Because people hate the ending mostly, I suppose. But you know, in a series this loved, you're never going to be able to make an ending that satisfies everyone, really, are you? It just doesn't doesn't work. It's very difficult to do that, <clears throat> especially in a game that has so many different choices and stuff throughout it. Like, geez. It, like it like it feels like oh, so many different possible choices well because there are and they all make changes even if it's only in a small way but then I guess I get the criticism that the ending doesn't really all your choices up to that point don't make a difference like it's just well it doesn't matter what you've done before just make a choice now but yeah I don't know. I don't care. I enjoy it. Just 2 has the annoying probing and 3 has the annoying scanning. Anyway, yeah. Don't really have much else to say. I guess I can review it. The graphics are still good, obviously. I don't know if it's just my computer somehow or if it's this way for everyone, but the, the way... there's so many weirdnesses in this game. I think there were in 2 as well, but more in this one, I feel like. The way characters bloody glitch around and teleport and stuff. 
like their head twitches, like their animation is just jumping to a different position, and the camera being in weird places, and just so much weirdness that I don't understand how it happens. No, the sad music is making me think of Garrus being all alone. I hope he at least masturbated on my name before he put it up on the wall. Um, but yeah, I don't know what to say. I don't, I don't like giving numbers anymore. Yeah. In the morning. Yeah, obviously all the graphics are good and everything still. audio and everything, you know, obviously the voice acting is all very good, the sounds are all good, lots of different gun sounds and stuff, and the music's good, it's all just very good. Yeah, I don't really know what to say. The gameplay, it's all just very good. Obviously, like, it, they get less RPG-ish as the series goes on, I guess. Like, there's less upgraded you can do and stuff, but whatever. Fun game. It's just fun to play. And even the multiplayer is actually quite fun if you're into that kind of thing. And the DLCs are like the best parts of the game, I think, almost. Especially DLC. Like, it feels like so much more love went into them somehow that they had more fun making them. But anyway, <clears throat> I guess I'd probably give this game a 7 out of 10. I don't know what I gave 1 and 2, if anything. But yeah, this one probably a 7 out of 10. Maybe even an 8. All families of patience and support. Oh, what's going on here? What the shit is going on here? Probably. Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. Oh. It all happened so very long ago. Who's this twat? No, he's not. When he, can I go to the stars? He's just a father. One day, my sweet. Oh, plenty of time, be there. my sweet. Anything you can imagine. Oh. Our galaxy has billions of stars. Who is this even supposed to be? Each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And why are they acting like they can't travel the stars? Every life is a special story of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story. Oh, is that Andromeda? No. Shepard's probably not in that. Although I imagine they probably reference Shepard. Ah, congratulations on bringing an end to the Reaper threat. Commander Shepard has become a legend. Already was. And from here, you can continue to build that legend. It has been a long journey for Shepard and for the team here at Bioware. And like Shepard, we couldn't have done it alone. The Mass Effect trilogy began as the vision of a small team. But over the years, it has grown. The growth oh, has been fueled and shaped by Garrus's naked uh, by by the feedback and support of our player community. So they're talking about their growth, not mine. Thank you for joining us on this journey, and we look forward to sharing further adventures with you in the Mass Effect universe. The Mass Effect team. Yeah, do we get to continue? Hi, I'm actually alive. Hi, everyone. It was all just a joke. Cerberus Oh, right, this is before the uh, point of no return then. Well, I guess to bring this playthrough to a close, let's feed the fish. I guess we had the auto fish feeder. <coughs> Can I bring Garrus to my room one last time just for, just for good old, good old bit of happiness? Ah, ah, get off, excuse me, oh you have to click, I don't remember that, 
Let's see all those armors that we got actually. Look at that, Neff. Yeah. yeah, that might have been good. Hani Kadar. Oh. oh, hey, what? What did I have on before? Oh, that. Yeah, you know, some of it might be all right. But no, health is all important. Yeah. Music. I just want to go see Garrus before we go. Oh, look, Anderson didn't die either. Hi. Head chop deluxe. Oi. Chop. One more chop for the road. Stop in and see a couple other people on the way, as in Liara. A pleasure to see you. Feel free to look around. Oh. Seems like people aren't even gonna have anything to say. At least Liara doesn't. She look like she doesn't even have a little chat when you go in there to whoever she's talking to all that time. Ah, oh, Garrus, I'm still here. So the elusive man really believes he can control Reapers. Yeah, but he died. Husks are one thing, but a whole fleet? The man is insane. He is, actually. Well, thanks for joining me on this trilogy adventure of joy and stuff. I hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, next up, should be a return to Skyrim for the weekend uploads. Get those DLCs done, which I've never played before, so should be interesting experience. Quite a possibly long one as well, because I like to explore. Well, I was going to say, like, especially for my first time playing, I might end up spending a lot of time exploring, but I kind of did that in the Skyrim playthrough anyway. But yeah. Anything else? A lot of Turians went to Sanctuary. When I meet the elusive man, I'm going to carve their names into his skull. Sounds like a plan, man. Not right now. Oh. Hmm. I'm quite happy with all the action we've got got with Garrus in this game. I wasn't expecting so much. Like obviously Citadel was a whole new experience anyway, so I didn't expect any of that there wasn't anything to expect other than fun but um yeah but we even got some kisses and bedtime outside of um stuff outside of the DLC but now before we bugger off there's just one bit of unfinished business one tiny bit of unfinished business. Ah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Yes. 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 I will win. New player. Me, new player. I will win. What lady? Right. You can't win. Fuck off. Yeah. It was good to be back. What a horrible dream all of that was. Oh, wait for Jack. Oh dear. Okay, one final little scene. Hey. Hi. Glad you can make it. I've got us set up. For what? Oi. Are you forcing me into a battle? 
Oh, what an absolute tit. I didn't agree to this. Oh, my helmet has changed. It's just me and you. Hi, Glyph. No. Oh, male slot. Did the Cerberus people agree to this? Using their likenesses. Head gone. Just like the good old days when people were alive. Oh, that's mine. Get away from it. Dead. Dead. Ow. That's not someone. Kill streak majorly lost. Whoa. Well, we certainly weren't going to beat that in time. What? What has occurred here? Whoa. Calm down. Poof. Is it? You don't like the kids? Yeah, I do. Talking about my Garrus babies. Do we win? What? Whoa. Wow. Thanks for coming, Shepard. Yes, yeah, alright. Wouldn't have missed it. Would have if I hadn't if I hadn't come here. But yeah, I guess Shepard knows best. I didn't miss it. Where am I now? Silly land. Right, yeah, that's truly the end now. So thanks for watching. And yeah. See you. See you, yeah. Yeah, in the next video that you watch. Bye. Uh.